Hello, boys and girls. Again, this is Miss D. Troy, and we're back with the second part of My Bad Hair Day, The Importance of Lines. Yesterday, we looked at this chart, and you guys should have practiced and practiced well. Now we're on to the second part of our lesson. Let's start drawing. First of all, these are the materials you will need. You will need pencil, eraser. You will also need uh, a Sharpie pen, a black Sharpie pen. You will also need a 12 by nine white construction paper, or if you wanna draw bigger, a 12 by 18 white piece of construction paper. Also, you want to turn your paper to the vertical uh, position, not horizontal. Um, this is known as portrait style. Now, let's get started. The first thing you're going to do is draw this U shape in the middle of your paper. Make sure it's big because this is going to be the head, the start of the head of your portrait. Remember, a portrait is a picture of a person. Next, boys and girls, I would like for you to add the neck onto that U shape. After you've done that, then we will close up that, U, that neck with a line going across. Then, boys and girls, as you can see, you will add this line, which creates a shoulder. Then, boys and girls, you will do the other shoulder on the other side of that neck. Boys and girls, now it's time to start our crazy hair. And as you can see, it is just, I just started with a line at the top of the head or the U shape. Then I added more lines. Be careful, make sure to spread these lines out. Zigzag lines, straight lines, spiral lines, whatever you feel. And notice that the lines are going to the very top of the paper. Then boys and girls, after you have had added lines all over that head where they're equally spaced out, then we're going to the next step. And that is turning the lines into shapes. I added a line that travels in the same direction as the first line that is called parallel. And then I'm going to close up the bottom of that shape so that uh, the, uh, it becomes a shape and not just two lines. There it is, boys and girls, right there, right there. Next, boys and girls, I do the same thing with each line that I've previously drawn. And I, as you can see, I have filled up the top. So there's my crazy hair. And I've got lines going in all directions. Now, boys and girls, I add a face with expression. And then, boys and girls, I continue. I've added a double that line for the eyebrows and added some eyelashes. Then, boys and girls, I go into each hair shape and I add more lines inside of it. And I just keep going. This is my bad hair day portrait. 
please have fun creating your portrait. Add as many hair shapes to your portrait as you like to make the hair look full. Have fun. The end. I can't wait to see yours, boys and girls. Ba-da-ba-ba-ba. -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it.